Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some Joe's candies. Uh, I have the birthday cake. These are cookies, and we'll describe them more in a minute. Birthday cake cookies, and then we have some barks. We have the uh, pretzel toffee bar, the roasted coffee bar. Raspberry bark, and then these are back to cookies. These are the raspberry cream cookies and dark chocolate. We want to try raspberry and raspberry, yeah. so because that's a strong, it should be a strong flavor. These were $4.99 each at Home Goods. Mm -hmm. So uh, these were the only flavors we found at Home Goods, but frankly, I was glad to find uh, this many because sometimes you can get a lot, and so, you know, sometimes they'll have one package sitting there. Uh, these are confetti cream cookies dipped in creamy white chocolate birthday cake. Cream cookies dipped in white chocolate. This is a five ounce bag. Um, it says snackable indulgences meet your new favorite time of day. Uh, these are made in Torrance, California. www.joescandies.com. One cookie is 120 calories. Wow. Yes. But wow. you know what? That's like the fudge covered Oreos and stuff like that. I mean, that's. Oh. The well, smell, the smell, it smells it's good. Now, they didn't coat all of them. No, it's like this one you can see. Yeah, it's like a messed up cookie. <laughs> I mean, it is. The way you said that. How many do you want? Just, have you guys got one to eat? I was, well, I was, I was giving you one. Is that, does that look like an Oreo in the bottom? Mm hmm Kind of hard to say. It's a, I like the Oreo flavor a lot. Um, it just tastes, tastes like a white coating to me on the outside. It doesn't taste like birthday cake. No. I guess adding the sprinkles makes it look like birthday cake. It's festive. But uh, um, as far as having that traditional birthday cake flavor, it really, it's just a, it's just a white candy coating. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's not even white chocolate if I had to guess. I like the um, I like the texture. Mm -hmm. I like the cookie, um, but I, I, it says white chocolate. Well, it doesn't taste like white chocolate. I do not like that white chocolate. No, it, no. it tastes like more one of those white confections. Yes, it has a funkiness to it. It's uh, they're they're um, you either have really good white classic white chocolate. Or there's a kind that companies use, and I'm telling you, it has a funkiness to it. It's not good. It's whatever, like the vanilla they used to put in there. That has it, yeah. and I do not like that. That is the, not the good thing is a lot Hershey's, of, the, like Hershey's cookies and cream nah. and white chocolate. It's not like that. Um, the good thing is the chocolate flavor is pretty. The cookie flavor is pretty strong, so it covers up a lot of that flavor, but it's still there. Yeah, it does not do that for me. Like I said, it mostly tastes like a white. Like one of those white candy coats you go buy at the bag, but like it, a Walmart meltdown. But it's not almond bark. No, 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 no. I'm talking about the little chips, the big oh, chips oh, that oh, you melt yeah, down yeah. and just okay. dip um, cake bites and stuff, right. and those kind of things. Yeah, they, they, they're cheap and they they taste okay. Yeah, I just I, I the, so a great job on the the, the texture yeah. and I, I love how it feels when you eat it. And they don't say Oreo; they actually just say cookie, and they say the ingredients. So. But it looks like that cookie it, has a name on it. I wish you could pick pick one out of there and pick see if you could pick it off. I will. I might try one of those. Yeah, something. see if you could pick it off and see if it's a, yeah, because it doesn't say Oreo, but it looks like um, it looks like there is a, a name on that cookie. Yeah, it's hard to say because all the white coating goes inside of it. So um, who knows? This is a pretzel toffee thin bar. It is salty and sweet milk chocolate snack with pretzel and toffee bits. There's five servings. One ounce, 28 grams is 140 calories. So this is one that you just have to weigh. Wow. Oh, that's two pieces of <laughs> that's thick. Yeah. And there's a lot of, ooh, there's okay. pretzel. Yeah, I see lots of pretzel, but I don't see much toffee. Hmm. I got the flavor of toffee. Here, you can put some of those back. Um, it's okay. It's nothing that I'd go out of my way to go buy. If somebody has it in their house, I'd eat a piece of it, but... The, um, 
the chocolate is you get the texture of the pretzel but it's not a really good pretzel no it's kind of stale pretzel it, yeah it seems like a stale pretzel it doesn't seem that salty kind of soft. Uh, it's kind of soft um if there are toffee bits in there then i got one that was laying right there it's, it's very soft as well okay so you don't get the any crunchy texture from the toffee it probably is adding sweetness to it but i didn't necessarily taste toffee mm -hmm. and the milk chocolate is not a deep rich milk chocolate no it's not bad it's okay there's nothing wrong with it but it's not worth uh five dollars for the bag i do not think no no it is... it's just regular ordinary chocolate nothing special no, about it no i agree yeah those pretzels left a lot to be desired yeah well it had that soft stale pretzel kind of texture that one was in a lot roasted coffee thin bark hmm. velvety milk chocolate snack with bold and rich coffee bits uh, which I like, Kevin normally doesn't. We'll That's see. how strong it is. We'll see. Five servings, one ounce, 28 grams, about 140 calories. Oh, watch this. Woo! The, it's the, all stuck together. That's the whole darn bag. Yeah, no, no, there's a little, there's one more little piece. So, look, it was supposed to be in squares like this. <laughs> It's just, it's just gotten melty. Yeah, that's okay. And that could have happened in our car. It could have happened in the car. It could have happened in the delivery it, truck. Yeah. Who knows? I it, can't pull it. It could have car. happened in the car. You never know. Okay. Although, we take a cooler with us and we try to... It's okay. I don't want all that stuff. Oh, you don't? don't? Not that picture. You don't want all that. So, you want me to put this back? Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Got those beetle shells in it. Do you not want that? No, I don't want it. Um, the um, the flavor is actually not bad, but they put coffee beans in it, which I absolutely hate the texture of coffee beans because it literally the shells taste like I'm eating a beetle because they're kind of crunchy. Um, Usually he says roaches. Yeah, I'll be nice and say beetle. He was shells. trying to be nice and say beetle for you all. Yeah. I just don't like it. I just don't like the texture. He didn't, yeah, that texture, I knew once I read the description. <laughs> um, it actually, the flavor's not bad though. It tastes like a raw coffee bean. It, um, it, it does taste like coffee. I do like it. It's, um, it, if you compare this to other uh, coffee in chocolate, this doesn't have as strong of a coffee flavor. So sometimes it's like a punch of coffee, like you are gonna wake you up in this chocolate. This is not like that. It um, it is strong, but it's not like I, I think the uh, the putting it with the the chocolate really dampens the coffee flavor. But now you do get a lot of you get coffee beans all through yeah. it. The crushed up coffee beans suck your teeth. And if that texture is not for you, you're gonna hate this yeah. because you can't avoid that at all. One thing I do like about it is it's not like. Some of the coffees that Tam's talking about, the really strong ones, are kind of bitter, like coffee. This is, I don't get any bitterness. No, that's what I'm saying. That, yeah, this is this does not have any bitterness. And honestly, so far for me, this is the best thing we've had. Flavor wise, it is. Yes. It's just texture cool. Okay, so now this, the last. <laughs> and that's a personal thing, you know, the texture of those coffee beans. Some people wouldn't mind that. Yeah, I don't mind Like our texture. son loves, he would just eat them. You know, Christina, our daughter-in-law. Yeah, they'll, they'll both chocolate just buy covered coffee beans. bag of coffee beans. Yeah, I like them too. You yeah, just don't. I just never would do that. Uh, so now lastly, we have two raspberry themed uh, foods. One of them is the bark. One of them is the cookies. So it's like, let's try both. Um, this is indulgent dark chocolate snack with tart and sweet raspberry candy. Five servings, candy. one ounce 28 grams is 140 calories. I was expecting to have dried raspberry, I was too. Dry raspberry candy. That's it different. says candy. I don't know what you want, so we'll put back whatever you don't well, want. I just want a piece or two though. Yeah, dark chocolate, and it it literally is raspberry candy. Now this is somewhat stuck together. That probably happened in the trunk of our car, you know? Yeah, I don't want to blame yeah. them. But you know, it could happen in the shipping people too. It doesn't look like candy. I guess it could be. 
It's definitely candy because I'm looking at the ingredients. Well, I mean, it's, it's, um, it's like sugary, mm -hmm. like a hard candy texture. Yeah, if it had been like dried, frozen, freeze dried raspberries, I wouldn't have liked it. Mm. You, you do get the raspberry, that's for sure. Yeah, and, and I, I think the raspberry is what you expect. There's some tartness there. Mm -hmm. um, it reminds me of those little raspberries, the little hard discs that are bumpy. Yeah, but those are have more sweetness. They are, but they remind me of that kind of raspberry flavor. Um, they the, have like a little gel on the side of them, mm -hmm. I think. That's what they remind me of. I think it, 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 it's fine. It's Just okay. like I said with the other ones, it's fine. Uh, I don't think the chocolate is enough to elevate it. That's what I was going to say. Yeah. That's where it fails, honestly, is the chocolate. Yeah, even in the coffee bean, the chocolate really just wasn't No, if, when it comes to that chocolate, if that's where it's just not good quality chocolate. If you've eaten a lot of chocolate, a lot of different chocolates, you know good quality, and then there's poor quality, and then there's just kind of, eh. This is one chocolate. of those that's kind of, eh. It's, you know, it's just not, um, It's there's no... And depth though there's no uh, creaminess or mm -hmm. you know and so uh, in a nice box of chocolates you would get a piece of dark chocolate with uh, and it would have raspberry cream. and it would be like oh this is sweet and creamy and rich and decadent and you feel like you're being treated to something I don't feel that way no. with this no and, and a lot of that is the chocolate yeah it's just an okay it, chocolate. yeah uh, this is the raspberry Raspberry cream cookies dipped in dark chocolate. Rich chocolate covered cream cookies with tart and sweet raspberry candy. I'm once sure it's again, the same kind. Uh, one cookie, 110 calories. And I like the flavor of the raspberries. So. And there's six cookies in here. Do they coat them better? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. oh that looks really nice. Uh, that, uh, that raspberry candy looks really pretty. It's, uh, and I'll have a close up picture like I always do at the end. Do you know, if that's not an Oreo, some company's got the flavor down pretty close. Because the, the cookie tastes like an Oreo. That's my favorite. That's much better because the cookie mm -hmm. um, helps the, bring up the chocolate a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is my favorite bag here. Um, Those? Probably I'm, mine too, honestly. Really? Yeah, because the vanilla ones, the birthday or whatever they're called, they were just okay. Yeah, the uh, raspberry cream cookies, those are definitely, definitely the best. Mm -hmm. It, um, you still get the raspberry candy, and you it's know it, teeth a little bit even. you know it's the same chocolate that they use for the bar, but it's the, it's the addition of the cookie. That cookie, the, uh, the texture, the crunch of the cookie, and you taste the flavor of the Oreo. Yeah, I actually get the chocolate cookie flavor. Yes, I, for me, I actually taste the flavor of the Oreo in that one more than the birthday one at the beginning yeah. because of that nasty milk cho or white chocolate that they used. I don't like that. It, it messed up that whole experience for me. Whereas like this, the raspberry and this milk chocolate, it goes really well together. So that is one I would buy again. And you like the coffee one. I like the coffee. It, Except the chocolate. The chocolate, it fails on the, ch I, I really, their, their chocolate's just mediocre chocolate. Yeah. It really is. It's a bad chocolate. It's just one of those kinds like you could take it or leave it. Yeah, it's just mediocre. So it just, you know, you're spending $5. It's definitely not worth $5. $5 on six cookies. Yeah, you're better off going to, um, you Walmart could, or wherever get the Oreos, the fudge dipped Oreos, they're so much better. Well, but I think, don't those only come out at Christmas? There's one that's out year round and there's one that comes out there's at Christmas. There's one that's out year round. I'm thinking that, maybe I'm wrong, I don't know. Anyway, those are better. <laughs> Whenever you can get them, those are much better. Yeah, we always buy a box of those fudge dipped and give them to Ashley, our daughter, because she loves them so mm. much at Christmas. Uh, we'll put them in her stocking or we'll give them to her. Yeah, whatever. they may only come out at at Christmas. I know. I, I'm, not, I'm not sure. Uh, but yeah, when you know you can get a whole box of those and get a lot of them where this is only six for um, for five bucks, I suggest waiting. Yeah, yeah the flavor is much better. Yeah. Uh, so for me, uh, if I was going to recommend one, this would be it. Me too. But truly, if you see them at Home Goods, I, I think you can safely pass. 
I think you could just keep walking and save your five dollars. Sorry, Joe's. Yeah, sorry, Joe's candies in California. Uh, yeah, she said Grandma uh, began on uh, Ma in her home in Manhattan Beach, California. I'm very sorry. Seize candies. This is in California too. So, um, <laughs> hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.